Hello, this is Dr. Gay from First Lake MRI, and this is a case of bone marrow edema in a patient who had knee pain. So this is from six months ago. This is a view of their left knee. They had a femur up top here, a tibia down below. We have a little triangle here, the meniscus. This is another meniscus, the lateral meniscus. They had a small tear of the medial meniscus, and the most striking finding was this. This bone here, the tibia, along the medial side, was very bright, so it has fluid signal all throughout the bone called marrow edema. And also some fluid signal along the outside, periostitis. And the question is, what is this? They did have a meniscus tear, so we thought this was probably a stress fracture, but it also could be something called migratory osteoporosis, where you have a generalized region of intense marrow edema and the bone becomes weak. So they came back six months later after conservative treatment, and we see here that the Edema in the tibia is completely resolved, completely normal now, but now the marrow edema is up here in the femur, and it's even worse than before, and we see this horizontal band. This is a stress fracture line going horizontally through the medial femoral condyle. So this bone is very weak and really bright edematous, and the weakness has caused a stress fracture. If they don't stop weight-bearing and take it very easy, this could go on to collapse, and when this collapses, that could be a very difficult thing to uh, treat. And the meniscus, instead of being a nice black triangle like before, it's irregular and torn, so there's a complex tear without much of this medial meniscus. It's a lot worse than before. And again, this bone marrow edema has moved over here. So this may be what we call migratory osteoporosis, where it will migrate to different areas, and the bone is weak, causing a stress fracture, or this just could be a stress fracture where the stress fracture is resolved, and now the mechanics of stress are more prominent here, but probably migratory osteoporosis. And uh, thank you very much.